More Hoosiers right now are getting behind on their rent and really struggling to stay in their homes. Even before the pandemic, Indiana had the highest eviction rate in the Midwest and twice the national rate. Well, now a new solution is empowering everyday citizens to get involved. Our Logan Gay shows us how court watchers can help. We're at a, a new point in the ongoing COVID eviction crisis. Andrew Bradley with Prosperity Indiana says it's a one-two punch. Inflation and emergency rental assistance drying up. That's made the eviction crisis in Indiana even worse. Um, families who before never had any problems suddenly can't afford new rent hikes um, and are they're having to withdraw their kids from schools and find other communities. They estimate more than 110,000 Hoosier households are behind on rent and in danger of losing their homes. Many of them black and brown Hoosiers, low income renters, women led households and families. This is something Coffee Covey knows all too well. He moved to Indiana from West Africa. He says the crisis has hit his community hard. Especially when we from Africa and stuff like that, there's a lot of information that we, we don't know. Covey says he has seen the evictions impact his neighbor's mental health and makes them feel less than human. He was one of several tenant advocates who met on Sunday to address the crisis. We cannot avoid avoid it, but we can at least reduce it in the community. They launched a court watching toolkit that allows advocates to take action during the eviction process in court and create a record of the proceedings. An important extra set of eyes. Bearing witness to the eviction crisis in Indiana and then sharing that story helps us as advocates be able to take those stories on your behalf to Indiana's legislators and be able to say this is a top priority. Kobe plans to become a court watcher because he wants to see justice done. We are trying to get information to see how we can help them, how we can contribute to better their life, to get them back to their feet. This is a way that you can take action and you can be part of the solution. And if you're interested in becoming a court watcher, it's actually a pretty simple process. We can walk you through it tonight with this story on WTHR.com.